Hello, dear students. Thank you very much for joining. My name is Hamid Asghar, and on behalf of Institute of Freelancing, I welcome you all. This sequence of lecture on this core topic, Coral Draw, and we are discussing about the different tools. And today, what we are going to discuss is the contour tool. So, what exactly is contour, and contour, how does we can apply and play with this tool? Simply, you click on this contour tool. This actually apply a series of concentric shapes that radiate into or out of an object it means you simply click here and you select the object first whatever the object you are actually applying let me click here if you click on the inner side like for example something like this and if you click outside here we go it automatically clicks on the outside and once you click inside it automatically redirects you to the inside so for example you're applying on the same to this circle let's click on this object so that it has been selected either click outside either click inside you have defined the offset of contour it means the difference between one line to the second and second to the third and third to the fourth and this will be continued Either you are redirecting this radius to uh, contour to inside or outside. This time I selected this circle and if I click outside automatically, depending upon this radius contour offset, it will be created these lines. And the same if I click inside something like this and then we can keep on doing, for example, something like this, it will be created inside. So uh, same goes to, uh, let me undo this and let me select this object now and let me go to the center of this. Whatever the line which will allowed with the, depending upon this offset, that will be what we are the contours inside. Same applies on the other tools also, uh, or the same thing can be, be done. For example, we are interested in the four and five and six whatever the offset that you can redirect outside that will be automatically generated so let me undo this and let me give you into the properties panel there are multiple other options also for example if you are interested uh, the center should be in other color let me undo this so that that should be a standard format uh, the outline right now is black whereas this uh, the uh, outline uh, or the center line should be white let me go with this option and let me show you that how this would react. So instead of this, let me pick up this one. So have a look at this. It will be a kind of gradient on the lines. The outer line would be defined black and the center line would be defined white or in any other shape, any other color if you are interested in. So let me zoom in a little bit so that to clearly define you that automatically it actually blends the color from black to yellow. So things like this, and then you can do this with the fill colors also. And then there is another option of object and color acceleration. Acceleration means object, or whatever you are actually in fact trying to create and the colors as well as it, it in fact they are, are uh, locked here. So you can either unlock and do this with the object also, and the colors manually also and things like this so plenty of interesting tools that i can create with the help of this tool so let's have fun let's create something with the help of these contour tools that will i'm pretty sure that will help you a lot in your creative things so that's it for the contour tool and we are going step by step moving ahead to the tools and eventually let's get ready for the creative classes in that we'll be using the same tools and we'll be creating we'll be coming up with variety of interesting and new and new shapes and the creative things that we can create with the help of these tools so take care of yourself and after then uh, keep on um, uh, joining me on this uh, different whatever we are actually uh, learning the tools and uh, uh, very soon we'll be uh, moving to the creative process. Thanks a lot. Take care. Bye-bye.